here in April. ECW is having their very first pay-per-view, barely legal from the ECW arena. Would that have been a pay-per-view you would have watched live or on tape? No. Neither one. <laughs> Correct. Okay. Even when you're, you guys have a relationship and you're sending talent and all that, just no interest. I, I, I don't remember. So I, I really, I, I don't, uh, if we had somebody on it, Howard would probably bring me a tape. Tell me about it. I watched your first pay-per-view they ever had. That's what I'm talking about. This one. This is it. Yeah, this is it. This is the one with Lawler. No, no, that was the second one. Lawler and Tommy Dreamer was hardcore heavy. Well, well uh, yeah, but Lawler came out at the end of this one. This no, this is where Funk won the title at the very end of this one. Taz and Sabu were involved in this one. If that's what you're thinking, right, is this the one where I told Paul he exposed his business? What uh, I think, whatever the very first one they ever had, I did watch. This is it. And I told Paul he called me afterwards, and I said, "Well, Paul, I think you exposed your business tonight." And he said, "Well, that's a good thing." I said, "Not in this case." Because up until this point, the ECW show was a compilation show. Oh, I see what you're saying. And it, it, you, you never saw you never saw matches. Right. You saw highlights. Right. And uh, he said, "Because so, no, that's a good thing." I said, "No, this one's a bad thing." I said, "Jesus," because some of those say, "Look, I defy anybody to go back and watch it with an optimistic eye, with a, with a, with reality glasses on." Okay, not oh my god, I, no, go watch it with reality glasses on and tell me that that was a great show because it wasn't, it was terrible. It just, it, it was a lot of guys just were, were exposed because people had never seen them before. I, you know, in a lot of respects, I hadn't seen some of them before, right? I'd seen the highlights, highlights are great, and again, that's where I credit Paul Haven's genius, he was able to get the absolute most out of anybody he had. And in this situation, he allowed them to go out and work for 20 minutes when they should have been out there for eight. Let's run through the, uh, the card. Uh, I, I appreciate that you pointed out that, you know, these guys couldn't work a lick. So let's run through it. Louis <laughs> Napoli wrestled balls Mahoney. They were both in the WWE. Mm -hmm. uh, Kronos. Yeah, did, tell, tell me how many matches that actually either one of them ever had more than, Seven or eight minutes. Saturn was in the WWE. The Dudley boys, both in the WWE. Mm -hmm. Rob Van Dam and Lance Storm, both in the WWE. Mm -hmm. uh, the six-man tag, well, that became Kai and Ty. They were all in the WWE. Shane Douglas was in the WWE. Taz and Sabu, both in the WWE. Wasn't it? Uh, Terry Funk. Shane wasn't in before. Shane wasn't in after this. He wasn't in after. No, he was before. Uh, Terry Funk, Sandman, and Stevie Richards, and Blue Mini, and Nova, they're all yeah. in the WWE. How they they do, except for Terry Funk. My point is, almost everyone on the whole... Sure, show, we, had, we bought ECW. <laughs> the fuck? I just love... Hey, these guys... Wait, first the, been, no, I, no that's not, I didn't say these guys. I said this fucking goddamn pay-per-view. I said that some of them should not have had. He allowed them to go too long where it exposed some of these guys couldn't work that kind of match. And they couldn't. And Balls Mahoney and Louie, and I love Louie to death. They couldn't work fucking a 20-minute match. Balls could work a three-minute match. Was he entertaining? Sure. But come on, be honest. Go, don't don't sit there and look at you. Oh, this guy. Sure, they were. Steve Austin fucking did a stint in ECW too. A lot of people did. Bruce, you uh, you don't have to get hot about it. No, nah, get hot about it. Did you fucking, fucking? Yeah, shit. A lot of them fucking were. <laughs> but you go back and watch it. You go back and fucking watch it and tell me if it was a good fucking pay per view or not. It wasn't. Everybody was like, just, oh, so happy because ECW yes. was on pay-per-view. It was a celebration of them being on pay-per-view. Yeah, than hip, hip, hooray. Yay, they got on pay-per-view. Somebody allowed them on. 